okay, this is a more challenging optimization problem. Um, once again, uh, this would take very long time for me to walk through all the steps. So I'm going to help you with the setup and then the next screen will show you the steps and hopefully you can fall along that way without me turning this into a 15 minute video. All right. So two vertical poles, one five foot high and the other 15 foot high are 48 feet apart uh, on a flat field. And the reason they say flat field and vertical is because then that tells you that you're dealing with right angles. And then if there's a distance formula, that's why they give that information. If the worker wants to stake both row, let's see, a worker wants to support both poles by running rope from the ground to the top of each post. If the worker wants to stake both ropes in the ground at the same point, where should the stake be placed to use the least amount of rope? So let me get rid of this. So here are your vertical poles. And I really should have made that kind of a, a more brown color, but here's the rope. So he's going to support this pole. And he's going to support this pole. And he wants to minimize the amount of rope. Well, that's this, this amount right here. Here's the rope. Well, here's this triangle. This is going to be a distance problem, and this is going to be a distance problem. And what do we know about the distance formula? It's the square root of x squared plus y squared. So the square root, this side, this x value, this length, is 48 subtract x. Because if the whole length, if they're 48 feet apart, but right there at some place, there's going to be a, a mark between this triangle where this one is supported and where this one's supported. So if we name one of the sides x, the other side would have to be 48 subtract x. So that's where I got this. And then uh, that height is 15 feet, but that height is also y. Um, and I'm trying to think, I think I went ahead and put y. Nope, I went ahead and put the 15. So this is going to be 15 squared. And on this side, this is just going to be x squared plus 5 squared. All right, on the other side is going to be doing the work uh, of simplifying all that. But that is the setup for these vertical pole ones. Let me go to the next slide, sorry. All right, that's it.